can now say is that a new form of medicine has been born. The field now is poised to explode because what's happened over the past five or six years is the proof of, of the concept that you can really put genes into people and, and correct their disease. Um, but as you know, it's had a rocky course and, and uh, it's been a long time in coming. But we now know it can be done. Uh, and now it's poised to move not only from the current set of diseases that are sort of rare diseases and that don't involve too many patients to the much broader class of diseases, cancer and, and uh, psychiatric disease and, and uh, uh, things that affect our population in general. Uh, so we now have three diseases, uh, maybe four, that are, that are certainly treatable with genetics. Uh, and the whole community is poised now to deliver these same techniques to uh, scores and scores of other diseases. We're now past the stage uh, at which we're trying to prove something to somebody uh, and trying to overcome our, our history of, of maybe promising too much and being criticized for that. Um, and and um, now are at the point where we can now begin to deliver real th treatments to real people. The way in which stem cell work is going to intersect with genetics uh, is, is uh, clearly, uh, they're going to be interrelated technologies uh, to manipulate stem cells so that they really are therapeutic. We'll take genes, so that's gene transfer and gene therapy. So it's going to be quite an amazing time.